Simple G makes it easy to diagnose problems that you may have with your top load washer should you run into any issues, saving you time from calls and services. If an issue occurs, your washer is programmed to display error messages that may help assist you in getting your machine up and ready again. In this video, we will go over some solutions for the OE, IE, DE, and UE error messages. An OE error message may occur if the washing machine is draining water slowly or not draining at all. Check to see that the drain hose is properly installed. Make sure that the drain hose is not pinched, clogged, or frozen. An IE error message is an indicator that water is not being supplied to your washer or that the water pressure is too low. Make sure that your water lines are properly connected and turned on. Check to see that the water lines are not pinched or bent and that there are no leaks. Next, check to see that your water inlet filters are not clogged. The water pressure must be between 14.5 and 116 PSI. If you receive a DE error message, this may mean that the washer lid is not closed properly. Make sure that the lid is properly closed and then press the start pause button. The washer will not spin unless the lid is completely locked. A small UE error message is an indicator that your washer has detected an unbalanced load. This code will display while your washer is attempting to rebalance the load by adding more water and redistributing the clothes within the tub. Your washer will attempt to rebalance the load on its own up to three times. This is an automatic attempt and no action is required at this time. If you receive a UE error message and your washing cycle has been paused, this means that your washer was unable to balance the load on its own and manual redistribution is needed. Rearrange the items in the tub to help balance the load. 